Hi and welcome to SQL Injection Master Course. My name is Hitesh and below is my web homepage www.hiteshchaudhary.com where you can access details and can leave your very very valuable hello to me. So let's move on to the lesson number three and and in this lesson I'm not going to do a lots of things but you have to do so this is more about an assignment type of lecture but really I'll make sure that I assist you in all those assignments not like all those college lectures and assignment in which teacher doesn't uh, assist you just gives you an assignment and that's the condition of most of the universities out there I really want to change that so let us proceed and I have already started my web server Apache and my SQL as well now for this lesson you are going to need the lesson 3.zip file which you can get from wherever you have purchased my course on lots of platform I am there on the global scale at lots of platform if you have purchased it directly from hiteshchaudhary.com then you can ask me for this course if you haven't find it there so don't hesitate to drop me email I always always reply to each and every email so what we have to do first of all we have to travel to desktop and verify that yes lesson 3.zip file is there then I can move it to my slash word www and what I have to move I have to mention it that as well so I have to move lesson 3.zip into this destination so the file is gone from the desktop let us also travel to the slash word www directory and verify that it is here oops I placed it in a wrong position I actually should have placed it in the master directly okay so it has moved to the master ls yes the lesson 3.zip file is here what simply you have to type is unzip lesson 3.zip file so just having two files one is image and one is index the image is just to make the things interesting and a little bit annoying as well so go to the master type the lesson don't forget l is caps lesson hyphen 3 and here it is and here is the small annoying image if you scroll it down you will find it here okay so here is a little annoying image so what you have to do in this case you again have to put a question mark id equals 1 as soon as you put the id here what the things will become interesting here in this case would really be interesting for you when you will put a single quote here now the target here is actually the same in this challenge you have to find out the database name some tables and quite other things when I do a single quote here it gives me an error yes and if I try to fix it by hyphen hyphen plus it doesn't fix up now that might be a scary but the important thing is out here you need to understand what you need to do by breaking the queries and what you need to do to fix the query so errors are always favorite uh, in this case I'm just going to fix the query and break the query and rest of the thing I'll leave it to you so that's the really good way to understand the SQL injection so when I did a hyphen a single quote it breaks the query it also gives me a very good and important error message here hope it's visible that it says syntax to use near double quotes one double quote and a bracket now that's the thing very everything goes interesting and one method that I've already taught you is backslash now backslash gives you inside crisp details about how to break the query if I do that you find out oh there is a single quote and a bracket here so in a, in case I want to fix this query and there is a simple rule with the quotes and bracket that they always comes in pair so I can put a single quote and a closing bracket that is going to again break the query but if I do a hyphen hyphen and plus sign here that fixes up the query now what can I do I can proceed to order by one okay if I do order by four error so we already know we have already numerated the database so database is going to remain same and I can use that leverage but don't use that in the real case okay and let's make it like this okay so things have got clear up so this is really a quite a short video just to give you the lesson number three make yourself comfortable with this baker of query and understand that every time the blind working like single quote and hi putting hyphen hyphen plus and doing all the things it's not going to work try to enumerate the lesson the errors 
as much as possible. So that's all for this video and thank you so much for watching.